It was Sunday on January 1, 2006. What was the day of the week? January 1, 2010. Here this is January 1 and this is also January 1. In that case, here this 2006 is not a leap year. So, 2006 to 2007. Here, month and dates are same. So, 2006 to 2007 contains one odd day. Again, 2007 to 2008. 2007 is a non leap year. So, 2007 to 2008 contains one odd day. Again, this 2008 is a leap year. So, this contains two odd days. So, 2008 to 2009 contains two odd days. Again, 2009 is not a leap year. So, 2009 to 2010 contains one odd day. So, total five odd days. Five odd days total means 1st January 2006 is Sunday means Sunday plus 5 is Friday is January 1, 2010. So, option B is your answer. I will explain it in detail. That is 1 January 2006 is Sunday. Then 1 January 2007 is here this 2006 whole year contains 365 days. Plus, first day of 2007 constitute 366 days. Then the difference between these two will be 365 days. This 365 days contains one odd day. Again, 1 January 2008. Here this 2007 whole year contains 365 days. Plus, first day of 2008 constitute 366 days. Then the difference between these two will be Again, 365 days. This 365 days contain one odd day. Here, Sunday plus 1 will give you Monday. Again, Monday plus 1 will give you Tuesday. So, again, 1 January 2009. Here, 2008 is a leap year. So, this whole 2008 year contains 366 days plus first day of 2000. 9 constitute 367 days. Then the difference between these two is 366 days which contains 2 odd days which means Tuesday plus 2 will give you Thursday. Again 1 January 2010. Here this 2009 is a non leap year which contains 365 days plus first day of 2010 constitute 366 then the difference between these two is 365 days, which contain one odd day. So, Thursday plus one will give you Friday. So, this is the concept.